So it's hot as hell outside at Tampa Pride 2017, but I'm standing next to the hottest guy at Tampa Pride, Steve Grant. Welcome, Steve. Thank you very much. We're not making ourselves cooler by holding on to each other, but we're spreading the love. That's what we're all about here. That's right. Tampa Pride is all about love. And Steve Grand, this year, was one of our Grand Marshals and performers. You're going to be performing on the stage at 4 o'clock today, right? That's right. 4 p.m. right here at the main stage. That's only in about two hours. So come on and check it out, guys. Very cool. And we saw you wandering around the other night at the VIP party, um, you know, all sporting your, your suspenders, which I see you have one again today. You yes. have a trademark. It is kind of, it's become, become my trademark a little bit. I haven't even been doing this a year, but already some of my fans are saying, they're like, you need a new look. I was like, it's not even a year old. But right, give me a break. <laughs> I can't, I, I don't have the money to change it up that quickly. You know. You're, well, you heard him. Buy some more albums, spend some more money on Steve Grand merch, <laughs> and then he can afford to change his outfit, okay? Yes, yes. Leather is expensive. Right. It is. And speaking of leather, you've got a manhole t-shirt on. I do, yeah. I'm from Chicago, and there's a big history with manhole. Unfortunately, I wasn't even of age when the real manholes opened, but then they reopened it. One of my friends was the managers, and then it closed down quickly. But I still, I love the shirt. You know, the leather daddies in their leather, and it says manhole. What, what's not to love? Very cool. So this is your first time in Tampa, right? Yes, my first time here. How does it feel for being the end of March and being 85 degrees outside? Oh, it's wonderful. It's yes. A little bit warmer than Chicago, huh? Yes, it is. Yeah. Yeah. Very yeah, but we, you know, the difference here is it's it's 85 degrees outside. He's got a shirt on. If he was in Chicago and it was 65 degrees, he would be running around shirtless. That's right. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's just the culture there. We have a different version of of like what uh, constitutes as warm and cold. I always think it's funny that like, you go to LA and they have heat lamps out for like their 60 degree evenings, and I just oh we do that, that too. In fact, we <laughs> we put on fur coats when the temperature drops below 65. Yeah. So yeah, it's it's a little bit different. We're not about that life. We'll, we're in shorts and flip flops, you know, when it gets upwards of 40. So. Well, we're excited to hear you perform in a little while, and hope you have a fabulous time in Tampa. When do you go back? Thank you guys. Uh, go back tomorrow, unfortunately. But maybe I want to try to do the river walk before I leave because that's right by my hotel. Yeah, and it's real close to here. Yeah. Well, we hope you have a great trip back. I'm sorry you're not going to be here to serenade me on my birthday on Tuesday, but well, happy early birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday. Have a great pride. Thank you very much. Happy happy pride to everyone out there.